channel thanks so much for tuning in for another video in today's video I am going to be doing a trim and a blowout two things that I have not done on camera so I'm pretty excited about it I'm nervous because I don't know how this is going to unfold on camera so this is the unprofessional version of course because I'm doing it myself so the indicators that I had for trimming my hair immediately was shedding also I had a lot of tangling it was hard to start getting the comb through my hair when I was styling and the ends of my hair I could just tell they were frayed they were just raggedy and I could see the split ends I could see the single strand knots or fairy knots as some people call them but I could see all of the indicators all the signs all the warnings <laughs> that were coming my way that says hey you need a trim so I said let me just go ahead and trim this hair because it's well overdue trimming your hair sets the overall tone palette foundation for just your overall hair health now it is recommended that you trim your hair anywhere from 8 to 12 weeks but I have to do what works for me. You could eyeball and tell when your hair needs a trim. So it says eight to 12 weeks, but you have to do what's best for your hair when you need that trim. Trimming your hair is extremely important. It's vital, it's essential in your overall hair health, your overall hair growth. So let me just share with you very quickly, 10 benefits for trimming your hair. It keeps your hair looking fresh and vitalized. It minimizes damage done by split ends to maintain healthy, vibrant shine. It lessens frizziness. It promotes hair growth. It prevents single strand knots. It makes detangling your hair a breeze. It also helps in length retention due to the reduction of split ends and breakage. It makes styling your hair much easier. It makes your hair thicker and fuller and there's less breakage. The unfortunate part about having split ends and why it's so important to make sure that you cut and trim your split ends is because the split ends will travel up your hair shaft and it will stunt your hair growth. Okay, so now that you know all the benefits of why trimming your hair is important, let me show you everything I'm gonna be using for this video, from hair products to all my styling tools. So earlier I shampooed my hair and I used the Natural Sisters Activated Charcoal Detox Shampoo. This is made with tea tree oil. So once I stripped my hair of all of that nastiness, I had to double up on my deep conditioning, which is what I have on my hair now. So from Beautiful Maine, I have their Sweet Sugar Moisturizing Deep Conditioning Mask. And I also have in my hair, as far as a, a deep condition, my avocado hair mask. So I've got those two, and it's got fenugreek in it, and aloe vera juice, and all that good stuff. So I have that in my hair as well, which I'm going to wash out in just a moment. For my styling tools, I have my combs, I have my detangler, I have some hair clips. I actually went out and bought a blow dryer for the first time in a long time. So this is from Revlon, just a basic uh, blow dryer, nothing fancy about it. And for my heat protectant spray from Aussie, I will be using the Total Miracle Heat Protecting Spray with Apricot and Australian Macadamia Oil. And this is sulfate free. And for the star of the show, I will be using Shears from the company Savorna. This is the Raziku series. I hope I'm saying that correctly. These are high quality barber scissors. And it has a multicolor titanium coating. It has an adjustment screw, stylish handles, detachable finger rest, and 2.5 inch sharp razor edge cutting blades for silky smooth cutting. The razor edge cortex blades are perfect for all types of hair, thin or thick, coarse or curly frizzy hair, whether you're in a professional hairdressing setting or simply styling your own hair. So I'm hoping I have a really great experience with these shears because these are my first pairs of shears that I have actually spent the money to invest in. Um, these were like, um, how much were these things? $32.95. I got these off of Amazon and these also will be in my Amazon store if you would like to purchase these uh, beautiful uh, shears. You do want to make sure that you are using shears only for your hair. If you're using scissors or shears for everything else except for your hair, box cutting, opening up things just on blunt objects, that's gonna damage your hair. If you're dulling the blades and damaging the blades and then trying to turn around and trim your hair with something you just got done cutting a box open with or whatever else, that's gonna damage your hair. You do not wanna use just regular household scissors that you use for everyday use. You want to stick with shears specifically that are meant for your hair and trimming your hair only. And if all possible, try to invest in a really great pair of shears. Your hair, your ends will thank you in the long run if you take uh, the time just to spend a little extra just to make sure that um, you're getting the best for your hair and uh, giving your hair what it needs, which is a really great clean trim. This will be my first time, very, very first time using these and using them on camera. So 
we shall see if the shears are um, as great as it says, as well as worth the money. So I've talked to you about the benefits of trimming. I've showed you everything that I'll be using on my hair and what I've used on my hair already. So the next thing I'm gonna do is thoroughly wash out this conditioner and then I'm gonna get back on camera. I'm gonna start blow drying and we're gonna start trimming and we're gonna see how that goes. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so we can get started now. Just gonna spray this on my hair. go section at a time small sections at a time and just trimming what I feel needs to be trimmed how I can detect where I need to start trimming is especially if my hair is in twists I will start at the root of my hair and I'll take my fingers gently and just run it down the shaft of my hair you're pretty much gonna feel a consistent thickness from the root of your hair all the way down about the same size and thickness and then you're going to start feeling it thin out when i start to feel my hair thin out there is a point where you start it's like a dip it's like a point where you start to feel your hair thin that's where i feel you need to cut that's where i'm going to cut that's what i'm going to trim and you don't want to confuse the texture of your hair with damage sometimes it may be hard to detect if you really don't know what you're doing but you don't want to end up cutting length off like retain length off of your hair when it's not damaged and for my stylers i'll be using from natural club the styling flaxseed gel curl custard and yogurt and i'll also be using the sample packet of the male organics pomegranate and honey twisting souffle and i'm just gonna work that in my hair is still nice and straight Ooh, I feel them ends. They feel a mess. I'm going to have to cut right here. Bye-bye. That feels better. I'm going to put a little bit more of this gel because my roots is frizzy. And I'm just going to twist this up. That was an ugly twist, but nevertheless, it's twisted. I'm going to do another one, and then the rest of it, I'm just going to speed through. I'm not going to show you doing my whole head, because that <laughs> would take forever. All right, so we're going to apply the gel. See how it's hard to get through there? See how it's a big puff right at the ends? That's where it gets tangled at. That's what i got to trim off. And put a little of the twisting souffle on there. And I'm just going to run the comb. See how, see how it's tangled? I'm trying to get the comb through the ends. It's horrible. Take the, my fingers and where I feel that roughness, that's where I'm going to cut. These scissors are sharp. Oh my goodness. Bye bye hair. And I'm just going to twist up this section.
So this is all of the hair that I trim. Wasn't too bad, about a half an inch, an inch the most. So wasn't too bad. So my hair feels amazing. It feels so good from the roots all the way down to the ends, specifically the ends of my hair feels so good. My hair feels extremely soft and moisturized. So my hair feels good from roots to end. I'm glad I trimmed my hair. So now I can style my hair a lot better without it snagging and pulling, especially at the ends and just breaking my hair off and just making the situation worse. So basically I had to do damage control, like serious damage control, cause this was, it was getting out of hand. So in the future, I will never go that long without trimming my hair. So I think I'll be more consistent in trimming my hair like I'm supposed to and paying more attention to when my hair needs a trim. These little scissors, shears are the best. Like they feel so good and they're so, so pretty. But they feel so good. It made my hair feel really, really good. But I hope this video was informative. I hope it was educational. I hope you learned something from it. I hope you understand the importance of trimming your hair and how important, how vital it is in the overall health of your hair. So again, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up because it does help my channel. Don't forget to comment and subscribe. Until then, it's just Janine and I will see you on the next video. Bye guys. Oh, 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 oh,